The center of Oslo witnessed hundreds of Shia Muslims chanting Labbaik Ya Hussein, expressing their allegiance to Imam Hussein during this year's Ashura procession. Their aim is not only to mark Ashura for themselves, but also to make others aware of this great historical event. They made use of the opportunity to spread information about what they called the true Islam, that is, the Islam based on the values of Prophet Muhammad and his family, namely Ali, Fatima, Hassan and Imam Hussein, peace be upon them all. One of the Ashura slogans this year was, No to oppression in Islam's name. The participants denounced all forms of oppression and terrorism in the name of Islam. They explicitly mentioned the Saudi royal family and Bahrain's ruling Khalifa family. Holding Ashura processions is a tradition in several parts of the world. Norwegian Shia Muslims have upheld this tradition for several years. Ashura is believed to be the greatest symbol of human dignity and freedom. By participating in Ashura processions, Shia Muslims try to show the world that they are freedom-loving, peaceful individuals. However, they are ready to sacrifice their lives if confronted by war-mongering arrogant powers. This is Nekvison in Oslo, Norway. This is the start of a long winter night in Oslo. These Muslims are thousands of miles away from where it all happened about 14 centuries ago. They want to make sure the world gets to hear about one of the most significant events in the Islamic history, the martyrdom of Imam Hussein, grandson of Prophet Muhammad, in the desert of Karbala. Imam Hussein challenged the tyrant regime of the illegitimate Caliph Yazid. As a result, Imam Hussein and his 72 companions were massacred in a battle against a much larger army of Yazid. Muslims regard this as an extraordinary sacrifice to safeguard the values of humanity and justice. We are proud of ourselves, we are proud of our religion and we are very, very proud of the sacrifices that Imam Hussein al-Islam made for us. No one in the history of the whole world has made such a strong um, signal against injustice as Imam Hussein al-Islam. There is so much injustice in the world. There is Israel, there is the Palestine case, there is all the trouble in the Middle East, there is Saudi Arabia. So many uh, forms of injustice that it's very important for us to stand up against that. For almost a decade, Muslims in Oslo have been holding Ashura processions, with almost no coverage by the local media. Muslims complain that the local media is always on the outlook to find controversial events involving groups disowned by the mainstream Muslims. When it comes to important religious events such as this, marked by the active and contributing members of the Norwegian society, there's a total lack of media coverage. If they cover us today, Muslims who really stand up for Imam Hussein and march for freedom and for peace, that will go against the local and the international media struggling to show Islam as something which is horrible, which is bloody, which stands for hate. If they yeah, come out and show the real message of Islam, Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, the people will see that Islam is about peace. The sacrifice of Imam Hussein is believed to be the ultimate symbol of human dignity and freedom. Millions of Muslims mark the day of Ashura every year throughout the world. Even in Norway, that was once considered foreign to Muslims. But Muslims seem to have become a part of the Norwegian culture. And so does Ashura. Rehan Nekvison, Press TV, Oslo.